Yo, what's up guys? This is Felix from Giant Lifestyle. So today, Wednesday, May 31st marks one full month of no video games. Um, going to talk briefly about, you know, how I feel. Um, but before any of that, I just want to say like, I feel so proud of myself because uh, if you guys don't know my history with video games, uh, I got my Xbox 360, I think when I was 13. And I pretty much played every single day for, you know, three to 10 hours a day until I was 19. And then I went away to college. I brought the Xbox with me. I played a very little bit away at college. Um, but, you know, I was away at college for six months, decided to drop out to, you know, chase my dreams, goals, and uh, um, things I want to do in business and stuff like that. So because I had no money, I sold my Xbox in February of 2014, and I didn't get another one until July of 2015. So, um, just say March to June, just say March 2014 to June 2015 because I sold it in the middle of February 2014 and got it back in the middle of July 2015. So that's March, April, March, April, May. So like about 15 months I didn't play for. And you know, then I got it back, like I said, in July of 2015. And I basically have been playing just like I did in the past every single day for multiple hours a day since then. And, um, you know, I really started to notice like it was fucking me up and I was playing way too much, playing with toxic people and there's really no benefit to it all uh, besides it being an in instant gratification. But, you know, as soon as I get off that video game and go into the real world, those skills don't aren't transferable. So I decided, you know, for a long time, you know, probably like six months ago, I was always trying to quit. I was like, don't play for five days, don't play for 10 days. But just like a lot of people in this NoFap community, I was relapsing every couple days and I hated myself for it until just recently, April 30th was the first day, haven't played since April 30th, was gonna make it a video like every 30 days, but I'm just gonna count months because I feel like it's way easier. Um, so besides being super proud of myself, um, you know, I, I, there's so many feelings that I feel, just like kind of how you get from uh, the NoFap experience, I feel extremely grateful. I feel really excited for you know working on my life, um, and I just I just I just feel great. Like okay, so you know grateful. I just like for example, I worked uh, pretty long yesterday, oh, pretty much the whole day, and when I came home, I cooked a burger and some tater tots, and I just felt so grateful and really, um, I just felt so like so I just you just enjoy the little things so much more, and you enjoy your life more because. If a, if a day doesn't go so good, you can't run to a fucking screen in a video game and be like, okay, I'm good at this. You can't escape. And I feel like that shit, people do that with drugs and shit. And I, there's no room for me to escape anymore. If I don't like how my day is going or if I don't like any of that shit, I have to fix it myself. There's no instant, instant leave. Um, another thing, um, like this whole month in May, I've gotten sleep. I mean, literally in 31 days, I think I've gone to sleep later than 4 a.m., maybe four nights, five nights, I pretty much get eight hours of sleep every single night. Literally, I mean, before this, I would go to bed at two, three, four a.m. almost every single night, besides Sundays. When I played, I didn't play on Sunday nights, but you know, now I don't play at all and it's, it's amazing. Um, grateful, really just playing the fucking game of life, man. Like, I'm gonna go back to playing, but I think it's not until I really, you know, accomplish all the things I wanna do. I think I'm just gonna take a two year break and see what I do and compare it to if I ever do want to go back because I feel like slit video games just slow me down. I might go back because I do enjoy it, but I feel like I definitely need to take a break um, because I, I've been making this list for the past couple days of all the things I want to do. Like this isn't even on my goal list. Like I want to learn how to fly a helicopter in a plane. I want to get a motorcycle. I want to um, I want to go skydiving. How the fuck can I do that playing a video game? How can I do that just staring into a screen five, six, seven, ten hours in a day? Like, there's so many fucking things to do in life besides doing that. That comes to fapping as well. There's so many fucking things you can do just for a month. Make a list of all the cool things in life you want to do. Not your goals, just the experiences you would want to have. So, that's that. And then um, one more thing. I feel like I have seen some of the most beautiful women ever. Like, I have seen, like, obviously I don't, you know, have any, like, so, I don't have many social skills and... I still get kind of anxiety, but I've seen some of the most beautiful women I have ever seen, if it seems like, in these past 30 days. Um, 
just had an experience at this taco restaurant, um, quote unquote, no fap attraction, kind of, I'm not gonna really go into it. Um, but you know, this chick, you know, I locked eyes with her and you know, we were, we were kind of like just chopping it up cause she was the waitress and um, you know, it was interesting. So, you know, just playing, not playing fucking video games. Um, it feels great. I haven't told my homies that I play with um, that, that I'm not gonna be on for the another two, three, four, five months, however long. I just told them in the beginning of this month in May that I won't be on until June and they're like, all right, whatever. Um, but I can imagine, you know, once I tell them, um, once I tell them uh, when they hit me up tomorrow or something or this weekend, I play that I'm not gonna be on for a few months, they're gonna be pissed. But in the end, they haven't hit me up. They don't, they don't give a fuck. They only care if I do good in the game. They don't care if I do good in life. So if that's the case, they gotta get cut off. So that's how I've been feeling. Um, you know, one full month, no video games. Um, I feel like I'm really getting strong with self-discipline in all areas of my life. And I just want to make that update video, update video for you guys. So I'll see you guys in the next video. See you later.